Hey there everyone, just a very quick video uh, regarding some of the features that I had uh, incorporated into version 3.2.3 of the Community Theme Creator. It was a bit of a rush job, unfortunately, um, uh, to get that build out the door without a video already in place, so my apologies for that. Um, so anyway, let's cover these uh, two features that I had included. Now any view will do, so we'll just take the default view. And the first thing we're going to do is add a rectangle. And then we'll make the background transparent. And now we want to add a border. So I'll just adjust the thickness and give it some curvature and I'll go over the new properties in a second but first we'll we'll play around with the dash array And now we'll go to dash cap and uh, as you can see it's uh, altering the dashes here, a rounded effect. Just want to get the spacing correct so it looks equal. And just for effect, we'll place it around the wheel, the text, the text list, I should say. And you have to play around with the dash array because of the cornered edges and then this is a new feature because you can do dash offset or dash arrays on uh, ellipses and rectangles you can now animate it And a positive value will animate it in uh, the uh, an in, in anti-clockwise to make it clockwise you just simply um, make it a negative value like so and obviously changing the uh, duration you can speed it up slow it down now I'm going to add an ellipse and I should be able to just simply copy the attributes of the rectangle and paste them directly over the ellipse Same with animate, and there you go. And these also work in wheel item templates as well, not just views. Um, like I said, very quick video. Uh, I hope you like that. I've got more, more coming. Um, so just sit tight. I'm working on version 3.2.4 right now. Okay. Take care, everyone.